What's up guys? Today we're back with another video. Today we will be heading out mowing with the landscaping company. On the way over to the shop this morning, I stopped by Tractor Supply. They are running a one day sale for oil filters and mower blades. I picked up a half dozen of each, but let's hop in the Ram 2500, get over to the shop. Let's get loaded up and get on with mowing. Today we will be heading over to Lono County. We have two properties that we'll be mowing and we'll be using the new F-150 that we recently picked up here with a new feeling utility trailer. I'm excited to be back here on a mower and I really do uh, like lawn care here in Farm Sim and I can't wait for the start of the season but until then we'll do a few kind of mows every now and then here but if you guys do enjoy today's video please hit the like button. It's much appreciated and if you are new please subscribe for this comment here guys is one of my favorite trucks I actually drove this home last night I really do like driving this maybe I might just have to look for a crew cab 2500 similar to this uh, just kind of with the uh, four doors and the six and a half a bed but we're here at the shop we have to get loaded on up and we will be using the right stander and the walker mower so here it is guys the 2016 F-150 XL now we do have the logo on it which is neat but I definitely want to kind of put lawn care snow removal landscaping along the side of bed I think that would be pretty sweet here but let's get this door opened on up here it is a bit heavy but there we have it so guys we'll be using the right right here the uh, 72 inch right and the 48 inch walker one of the customers is asking that we collect the grass baggage we'll use that and then on the other one we'll use right here but we'll get loaded up and we'll catch you back Alright guys, we're all loaded on up here. I got the uh, trimmer, a few gallons of diesel there in the bed of the truck. We'll just put a tie down strap on both uh, for DOT requirements there. But let's get the garage door closed. Let's grab a few things here. Just my uh, cup of coffee, a few uh, snacks. And we should be good to go. Now, it looks to be about a 20-minute drive to Lone Oak County here today. Not much traffic, which is good for us here. And we have about two to mow. Maybe uh, we'll pick up a few more here. But it's always nice to be back here doing lawn care. And once spring comes along, we'll be doing the spring cleanups. And then we will be doing a lot, a lot of work, which I'm excited for. We recently did pick up this F-150 here, and I think it's going to be the perfect fit here. We just need a truck to tow the mowers around, while all of the other trucks, the 250s, the 2500s, are out with the landscaping crew, towing those skid steers, the excavators, and so on and so on. But guys, this is a pretty sweet setup here today. I think I'm going to put the camera down, focus on driving, and I'll catch you guys back here when we're getting close uh, to lawns we'll be mowing. After a short 20 minute ride, we made it over to Lono County. We're actually just now pulling into the little subdivision here and we have two properties to mow in here. But wow, look at that guys. Looks like they're doing a lot of construction. There is a lot of new homes being built all over here, which is good to see. It's nice to see uh, these uh, lands get developed here. But so far the F-150, especially on the drive over here, there were a few uh, hills and a few long straight away roads and the F-150 did a pretty good job here now that uh, two houses we are mowing is actually right across the street from each other which works out pretty well here so one of them is actually this house here with a huge retaining wall there is a pretty steep hill and the other one is this house to our left hand side so let's kind of get parked over here and looks like there is a construction site there we definitely don't want to be blocking any road uh, since vehicles do need to get in and out here but hope you guys are excited for the springtime can't wait uh, to do these and the plan is to do a landscaping 
lawn care video every single week and uh, definitely have a lot of fun with that here but first up we'll be using the walker here the client uh, that we actually parked right next to they uh, kind of recommend us to use it uh, because they much prefer their lawn be collected which is no problem here let's get the walker fired on up here I am a huge fan of these walkers as well they're so handy and having that built-in bagger really does help us on out here but hope everyone has been having a pretty good day here so far mine's been a bit busy with schoolwork and uh, but I'm really excited for what's to come especially this summer as well let's see wow look at that they have quite a few big hedges right around the backyard area they actually have a pool over there mowing oh look at that guy's taking a few branches there uh, to the uh, arm there but let's see if we could do a little bit better job trying to get as close as we can to make it a little bit less weed eating here for you guys but definitely am excited to be back here on a mower and uh, this is pretty sweet here now many of you guys have been asking for more first person view which is definitely the plan going forward as well I really do like it especially on like zero turns it is pretty sweet here but let's see we do have a camera and tripod and we'll, we'll definitely be using that a little bit here in there uh, today but this property isn't actually too big which is uh, kind of helpful here for us it's good uh, because I am a bit rusty I haven't really been on a zero turn in a little bit of time but wow our setup today the F-150 uh, the utility trailer and both mowers is a pretty sweet setup and for uh, this upcoming season we will actually be running two crews I will be out on one and then we'll have a crew out with another truck and it should work out here for us but we are books guys for I would say two or three months into the season already which I'm excited for some pretty big landscaping projects and I think we have over 80 lawn care clients now which I'm also excited to have here that means business is booming and we have to make the most of it here and get all the jobs done so we can uh, get lots of money coming in. All right, we're pretty much done here at the first property. Just finishing up here on this section, but we'll be using the right stander on the other one. I think the right will be a little bit better on the hills and not the walker, since this does have an extra wheel here, and this is pretty full here. But let's hop on the right. I actually really do like stand-ons, and especially for hills, if we do end up kind of start to side, we'll just jump right off, and we should be safe here. We could always kind of get this mower fixed back on up here as well, but I can't wait, I, I, and I definitely want to do some real life mowing videos this year as well it should be a lot of fun and if you guys haven't already go check me out over on instagram i am posting every single day over there uh, some pretty cool sneak peeks and updates about the channel as well lots of cool things happening and uh, this summer i do want to get into a lot of live streaming as well and have you guys hop in game here but the right is perfect especially for uh, small areas like this as well but uh, this has a pretty big hill in the backyard so that's gonna be a lot of work now I am always looking to get new mowers here so maybe this year we'll do a lot of demoing here. I definitely want to buy another mower as we keep growing but I'm not sure which brand and if you guys do any cool ideas here please let me know as well. Definitely want to check out some of the new brands as well but I also want to check out some of the most reliable brands like Xmark, Toro, things like that. It's always nice to just kind of see what out is out there and uh, we definitely do need to pick up probably another mower or two this year as well and uh, that means that we're doing pretty good in business here as well but you guys can see the right's doing a pretty good job but let's set up the camera and tripod and let's get the uh, rest of this property all mowed
All right, guys, we're sliding, we're sliding. We're going to have to jump off. All right, let's really quickly get the mower turned off there. Wow, look at that, guys. Luckily, we were able to get out of this on her, but look at that, guys. We did tear it up. It looks like we just started to slide down here. The hill's just a little bit too steep. I did see the mower kept beeping that we were over the 30 degrees that we should be uh, mowing at there. But look at that, guys. We were just mowing, and we kind of just went right off here. So definitely mowing gone wrong. Probably not the safest thing. We are definitely going to have to kind of just push mow this. I think that's probably going to be safer, or... that. Uh, we're gonna have to weed eat it or maybe we just kind of uh have the customer find a different company there but guys our mower this pretty expensive mower is now on a retaining wall here let's see if we can lift off the back wheel and there it comes off here looks like we do have a little bit of damage uh but it didn't roll over on its side which is a good thing here looks like the retaining wall is uh, stones looks like we have some scratches things like that but the good thing is that our mower did not get damaged we didn't get hurt and that is always a good thing here wow that do, definitely seems to have a lot of damage looks like we're gonna have to be bending back a few uh pieces of the mower deck there but i think that's pretty much it yeah i think we'll call it a day here so let's hop back on the mower uh definitely not what we wanted to do was slide right down but uh sometimes things happen you just kind of uh kind of go along and you just kind of gotta make the most of it here but i'm gonna get all these loaded up here but i think that's pretty much it here for today hope you guys enjoyed today's lawn care video get into use a walker mower and the right uh definitely could have been a bit better if we did not slide off there but luckily uh, we got the majority of the lawn done but thanks for watching stay tuned for next one and subscribe for more